it's towards the end of the month, so it is time to do another updated everything coming and going from Netflix next month list. Um, I would have done this sooner, but there are some discrepancies this month as to the what's leaving Netflix category, um, and nobody seems to be able to freaking agree on it, so I finally just chose one and I'm going with it. So if more leaves, I'm sorry, but there is like two conflicting lists of what all there is. So both of them are ridiculously short. It's probably in reality all of them together, but what can you do? So anyway, um, I'm going by the live hacker list for, um, for what all is coming and going. So we're just going to go ahead and start. <laughs> so the things coming to Netflix next month, February 2019, are About a Boy, American Pie, American Pie 2, American Wedding, <laughs> no comment. As good as it gets. Billy Elliot. Isn't that that Elton John musical? I feel like it was. What did I just knock down? Oh, my hairbrush. Okay. Um, Dear X. Final Destination. Oh, heck no. Oh, no. Not Final Destination. Final Destination 2 traumatized me for like a month after I saw it years ago. Uh, so we know I'll probably watch this. Free Rain, Valentine's Day. It's a show. Hairspray. Which version? The Ricky Lake version or the Zac Efron version? They are not the same thing. Um, let's see here. Hostel. I feel like I've seen that at some point. Jaws, Jaws 2, Jaws 3, Jaws the Revenge. <laughs> How many Jaws movies are there? I didn't know there were that many. Uh, Personal Shopper, Pretty in Pink. I've actually never seen that, believe it or not. Uh, Russian Doll, it's a show. This one's not in English, so I'm gonna try and sign it out. Siempre Bruja. The Edge of Seventeen. True, Happy Hearts Day, it's a show. And Velvet Buzzsaw. On February 2nd, we get Border Town Season 2, which... I'm shocked that it didn't get cancelled after Season 1, so, um... It is horribly offensive to the point where even I was sitting there like, oh my god, like every freaking thing. But that is hard to accomplish. I kind of respect that, that they were that ballsy about it. Okay, so I'm knocking things down after. Oh, it's still my hairbrush! It just fell down on top of another thing. Ah. Anyway, so Border Town Season 2, just saying, um, if you are. If you are of the social justice warrior caliber, do not watch that show because you will get very butthurt and offended. Just, I I'm throwing it out there. Y you won't like it. Anyone else, um, proceed with caution. Th there's a lot, a lot, a lot of Mexican jokes that are in poor taste, but at the same time, I'd be lying if I claimed I didn't laugh. That makes me a horrible person, makes me a horrible person. But on the record, I have no issue with Mexican people, but I did freaking laugh at that show. So, anyway. Ah, uh, Romance is a bonus book, streaming every Saturday. It's a show. February 3rd, we get Beverly Hills Chihuahua. February 5th, we get Ray Romano right here around the corner. It's a comedy special. February 6th, The Soloist. February 8th, Nailed It Mexico. El Arbol... Della Sangri? I just butchered that name, I'm sorry. Um, High Flying Bird. Kevin Hart's Guide to Black History. No comment. One Day at a Time, Season 3. Remastered, The Two Killings of Sam Cooke. The Epic Tales of Captain Underpants, Season 2. Why? Why is Captain Underpants still a freaking thing? And Unauthorized Living. February 9th, we get The Break, Season 2. I've never even heard of it, but apparently it's on Netflix. February 10th, Patriot Act with Hassan Minhaj. Let's try that again. Hassan Minhaj, Volume 2, streaming every Sunday. February 11th, Flavorful Origins, Chaos Sean, or Chaos Sean Cuisine? Little Women, February 14th, Dating Around, it's a show, and Ken Jiong, or Young, one or the other, You Complete Me Ho, it's a comedy special. I'm intrigued by the title, I'll probably watch it. Uh, February 15th, Larry Charles' Dangerous World of Comedy, The Breaker Uppers, The Dragon Prince Season 2, The Umbrella Academy, and Yucatan, I'll probably watch that. 
Oh, 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 I just saw something coming up. It's not the next one, but it's the one after the next one where I'm just like. So Black Sea, that's not the one that excited me. Studio 54, though. Oh, my God. Okay, yeah, I will be dropping everything to watch that. Just if you, if you need to know where to find me that day, that that's where I am, no doubt, watching that. Uh, and the 40-year-old virgin, which I will just keep my damn comments on. I still am butthurt over that movie. I, I feel it sends horrible messages, but anyway. February 21st, The Drug King. February 22nd, Chef's Table, Volume 6. Firebrand. Go, Viva a tu Maniera. Paddleton. Paris is Us. Paris es a News. I'm sorry, I, I don't speak the language. Rebellion, Season 2. Sabura, Season 2. Big Family Cooking Showdown, Season 2. The Photographer of Mathausen. Or Mathausen? I don't know. Uh, Working Moms. February 25th, Dolphin Tale 2. February 26th, Our Idiot Brother. I feel like I need to watch that just for the title. February 27th, Unsolved, Tupac and Biggie. Oh, God. February 28th, Jeopardy Collection 2. Jeopardy is on freaking Netflix. It's kind of awesome, but also really sad. Just turn on Channel 7. It's on literally every day. And The Rebound. Now for the things leaving. It's Like I said, it's actually a really short list this month. Most of the things are leaving on the first. Black Dynamite. Bride of Chucky. I'm sure there's plenty of you sad over that one. Children of Men. Clerks. The Princess Diaries 2. Royal Engagement. I had a feeling when Princess Diaries 1 was leaving last month that, yeah, 2 is probably soon behind. Ella Enchanted, which... Would make me sadder, but I figured out who else is in it, so I'm not that sad. Uh, Laura Croft Tomb Raider. Queer as Folk Seasons 1 and 1 through 4. Queer as Folk, the final season. Why not just have the entire series listed? I, I just... Okay, whatever. Shaun of the Dead. Oh, hey, Dudley Moore's Illegitimate Son. Hey! I still haven't watched it. Uh, I should probably do that. The Big Lebowski. Did not realize that was on there. Um, I should probably get my dad to watch that since I bought him a car from that for Christmas last year. And he's never seen it. And I was like, oh, well, I just bought it because you have the real life car of that. But okay, whatever. Um, the Born Ultimatum and A Woman in Gold. On February 2nd, I almost said 22nd. 2nd, we lose Cabin Fever. February 3rd, we lose Sing, which I still haven't watched and I probably won't. February 19th. Yeah, just subtle jump. Subtle jump. Girl Meets World, seasons one through three. Oh, damn, I guess it wasn't that good. I watched the first few episodes and thought it was completely insufferable how bad it was, so I just stopped. And I loved the original series that it's based on, but it just did not do it for me. It's like Fuller House. It just doesn't do it for me. And February 20th, Piranha. That's it. That, that's all it's leaving next month. That actually is ridiculously short. And I'm shocked, because <laughs> usually it's a lot more than that. So, anyways, what are you most shocked is leaving next month? What are you happiest is coming next month? Or anything else? Leave it down below. I want to see discussions going on. Um, as usual, if you like this video, go ahead and give it a like. If you're not already and you'd like to be, click subscribe. Hit that notification bell icon so you never miss an upload. Again, leave comments down below about anything at all. Uh, make sure you're following my social media accounts, my Facebook fan page, my Twitter, my Instagram, Etsy, you name it, it's all down there. And if you like what I do here on this channel and you'd like to help support it, the donation link, as always, is down in the description. So, anyway guys, till next time, bye-bye.